The Sphinx, secret project for high intensity and new conflicts, was conceived by Panhard as an independent endeavor to fulfill a requirement from the French army for an EBCR, engine blind de reconnaissance et de combat, vehicle. The EBRC represents an armored vehicle meant for both reconnaissance and combat purposes. The aim of this new armored vehicle was to replace the aging AMX, 10RC and ERC, 90 Segei reconnaissance vehicles, as well as the VAB hot anti-tank missile carrier. The French army had a need for approximately 250 of these new vehicles. A mock-up of the Panhard Sphinx was unveiled in 2010. Initially, Panhard was expected to compete against Nexter and Renault Trucks defense to fulfill this requirement. Nevertheless, the French army opted for another design known as the Jaguar, developed by a temporary consortium of French companies including Nexter Systems, Renault Trucks Defense, and Thales. Thus, although the Panhard Sphinx was not chosen by the French army, it is being proposed for potential export customers. The 6x6 Panhard Sphinx was introduced alongside a lighter 4x4 Panhard Crab armored car. Both of these armored vehicles are characterized by their high mobility and are founded on a revised doctrine of light cavalry, emphasizing small yet swift and well-armed armored vehicles taking an active combat role. The Sphinx is versatile, capable of conducting reconnaissance, offering fire support, and executing rapid interventions. The vehicle features an all-welded steel hull with additional modular armor. This supplementary armor permits adjustments to the vehicle in the field to align with specific mission requirements. The armor of the Sphinx ensures comprehensive protection against 14.5mm armor-piercing rounds and fragments from artillery shells. An enhanced option for frontal protection against 25mm armor-piercing projectiles is also available. To enhance defense against rocket-propelled grenades, certain areas of the combat vehicle are equipped with slap armor. The vehicle boasts a V-shaped hull design and can withstand anti-tank mine blasts of up to 10 kg. It is equipped with an NBC protection system for the crew and includes a laser warning receiver. The reconnaissance vehicle is outfitted with a two-person turret housing a stabilized 40mm automatic cannon. This turret was developed by Lockheed Martin for the upgrade of the British Army Warrior Infantry Fighting Vehicle. It's noteworthy that the initial 2010 version of the Sphinx featured a Belgian CMI turret, which was later replaced with the Lockheed Martin turret to streamline production costs. The 40mm gun features a dual-feed system and a firing rate of around 180 rounds per minute. It can use a variety of ammunition, including programmable airburst rounds, and has a maximum effective range of 1,500 meters. This gun is capable of effectively engaging most armored personnel carriers, infantry fighting vehicles, and other targets. The Sphinx also has the capacity for four long-range anti-tank missile launchers, with missile pods mounted on either side of the turret. Additionally, a 7.62mm machine gun is coaxially mounted with the main gun. The reconnaissance vehicle accommodates a crew of three, consisting of the commander, gunner, and driver. Powering the vehicle is a turbocharged diesel engine generating 600 horsepower. The engine, located at the rear, is likely to be sourced from German manufacturers such as Mercedes or MTU, or Austrian manufacturer Stair. It is coupled with an automatic transmission. All wheels of the Sphinx are steerable, providing commendable cross-country mobility. The vehicle is equipped with a central tire inflation system and run-flat tires. Notably, the vehicle is not amphibious. In terms of transportation, the reconnaissance vehicle can be airlifted by the C-130 Hercules or larger military cargo aircraft. 